Sachitanan. Ya es Sachitanan. Buenos días, gracias Marce. Buenos días. Gracias Marce. Buenos días, buenos días. Buenos días. Buenos días. Buen buen giorno. Buen giorno. Buen giorno. Políglota. Guten Morgen. Good morning. Yes. Yes. Jai Sachitanan, huh? Jai Sachitanan. Jai Sachitanan. So let us begin with the three mantra, huh? All right. Liliana. Liliana, can you start with the mantra? Say I or Elsa, one of the two of you. Yes, Liliana. Hola. Buen día. Buen día. Namo Vitragai, Namo Ariahantanan, Namo Sidanan, Namo Ubasayanan, Namo Loye Sauba Saunan, Eso Pancha, Namu Karo, Sauba Pava Panasano, Mangalanan Cha Sauvesin, Padaman Javai Mangalan, On Namo Bagabate Basudevai, On Nama Shivai, Shei Sachitanan. Yes, Jay Sachidanan. Thank you very much. Huh? Uh, all right. So, um, so the next, you know, this is now. Okay, let me just put it in the chat. Hmm? The namaskars are conveyed to the eternal one, the uh, special eternal. One, the one, the only one within all uh, that is forever and that is the Shuddhatma Bhagwan. Hmm? <clears throat> and <coughs> we now today begin the 35th session of this uh, magnificent internal journey called Purnatva. Purnatva means uh, to, to become, to completely become who we really are, to be who we are in the complete sense, in the total uh, view, darshan. Hmm? <clears throat> yes. 
Bueno, comenzamos hoy con la sesión número 35 de este magnífico viaje interno Puno Atua, que es eh, eh, ser realmente quienes somos en total vis eh, visión y darshan. So the next heading is, you know, the next heading is, you know, the last heading, will really, spend the whole last of last satsang in... Uh, where Dada says uh, that if you remain in any one of the agnas, if you are in any one of the agnas, then it does not charge. It can not, not charge new karma. Mm. En, en, en la última, en el último satsang, estuvimos escuchando las palabras de Dada que decía que si estamos en alguna de las agnas, no íbamos a cargar karma. Yes, and so the next heading today uh, on page uh, 53 is the necessity is to remain in Agnas. Hmm? Agna, Agna. Hmm? La necesidad oh. es, es estar en, la, en Agna. Yeah, so in, in other words, what is really necessary, what is indeed needed is is to remain, to stay in the agnas, to stay in the agnas, or to remain in the agnas. Hmm? Es estar o permanecer en las agnas, esa es la necesidad. So the questioner says, you, Dada, you're saying that everything that happens, everything that is happening, is discharged and it is not under our control, then what do we have to do? What do we have to do? Yes. Yes. Hmm? Hmm? yes. Y le preguntan a Dada, todo lo que sucede es, de descarga, es descarga y no, estamos, no está bajo nuestro control. Este, entonces, ¿qué hacemos? ¿Cómo, cómo es esto? All is discharged and not over under, over under control, right? Mm. Yes. Mm. Todo es descarga y no está bajo nuestro control. So what do we do? So what do we have to do? Mm. Entonces, ¿qué es lo que tenemos que hacer? And so the other reply is, uh, you need to follow the five agnas. <laughs> y Dada responde, tú tienes que seguir las cinco agnas. Uh, the five agnas that are there need to be followed. Huh? Las cinco agnas que están allí deben ser seguidas. Need to be followed. Simple answer. Okay, that's it. Uh, everything else is discharged. It's discharging, not under our control whatsoever. So the, what is remaining now is, what do we do, Dada? Therefore, five agnas. What do we do? Five agnas. And so the, <laughs> uh, so the questioner says, correct. Uh, Correct. What else? <laughs> the question is just asking, what else? Huh? Entonces le preguntan a la a ver si todo es descarga y no estamos este, en control de nada, ¿qué hacemos? Y Dada dice, las cinco agnas simplemente. Y entonces le, le vuelven a preguntar, ¿y, ¿y qué más hacemos? So Dada replies, there's nothing else. You know, the questioner asks, what else, Dada? There is nothing else. There is nothing else. I say, uh, after this gnan, after this gnan, nothing new charges and the old stuff, and and the rest is discharging. The rest is discharging. As the time passes, uh, Dada says, the discharge continues to happen. All you need to do now is to remain in our five agnas. Remain in our five agnas. You see, remain in our five agnas. Be, there is nothing else. Just be, be in the five agnas, and there is nothing else. There is nothing else. Hmm? Yeah. There's nothing yes. else. Mm -hmm. 
Bueno, y le preguntan, bueno, ¿y qué más? Y nada, dicen nada más, no hay nada más, no hay cargas, lo que solo hay es descarga, el tiempo, descarga todo el tiempo y permanecer en nuestras cinco agnas, estar en las cinco agnas y no hay nada más que hacer. Be in the five agnas and nothing else. Hmm? Estar en las cinco agnas y nada más. That's, there's nothing else. He made it so simple. <laughs> he, oh, Dada, makes it so simple. We have come to the end of this heading, by the way. <laughs> he makes it so simple. Eh, es tan simple, Dada lo hace tan simple, tan simple. Mm. You understand Liliana? You understand what... Liliana? Uh, sí. Sí, sí, huh? Do you want sí. to say, say anything else? Do you a want... veces, a veces este, la descarga es fuerte y parece que nos lleva por delante. Pero bueno, este, la, la convicción o la fe nos vuelve a centrar. Pero eh, después, este, cuando todo está calmo, es más fácil cumplir los cinco años. Sometimes uh, the discharge is, is very strong, and, uh, but faith and, and understanding take her again. What I'm sorry, I didn't get. Uh, some, 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 sometimes the discharge is too strong and make her fall, but the, the faith and the knowledge uh, or understanding is uh, it's, uh, coming back to the five factors. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes, that's very good. That's how it is. You see this, but you know, slight correction. You don't fall, Liliana stumbles a little bit, but the gnan, like the solid earth, holds you, you see. You, you know, you might stumble, you might feel unsteady, but it's Liliana that feels, oh, heavy discharge, but you, you are not touched. You, Amapura, are not touched, you see. Hmm? Mm. Eh, no, no caigas en Liliana porque el NAN te sostiene este, ah, okay. eh, a vos nada te toca tú eres el alma pura y nada te toca gracias gracias ok, yes, good uh, good, it is just the whole Meaning of satsang, my friends, is to get it ex in exactness, not through the intellect, not through the intellect, but in the totality of our vision, in the totality of our vision, you know, in exactness. Hmm? This, it's hmm? Yes. Eh, la, la, para entender esto no es a través de la, de la entendimiento, del intelecto eh, de la exactitud del intelecto es en la totalidad de la visión la exactitud es la exactitud en la totalidad de la visión mm -hmm. uh, in that vision of the self and as the self Keval darshan, <clears throat> absolute, only absolute vision. In that vision as the self that I am. There is the experience of the self and the perfect state of the knower in which there is 
there is no one doing anything. It is happening. You see, it is all happening. Happening to Liliana, Luz, Marcella. Happening to. Happening to. See? <clears throat> Okay. That is Keval Darshan. I am not doing anything here. <laughs> yeah. no? eh, la, esa visión del, del ser es Keval Darshan, es la absoluta visión. Y yo soy esta, la experiencia del ser. Y en el perfecto estado del conocedor. Y nadie hace nada. Es lo que está sucediendo, lo que le está sucediendo a Liliana, a, a todos. A, uh -huh. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah. Estoy haciendo nada. So then, then in that vision as the self in the morning when you wake up sometimes, you will become aware in the morning when Shuddha wakes up, Arman wakes up, Al Elsa wakes up, Marcella wakes up, there is this. You're able to see that you're not You're not as clear. <laughs> You're not as steady, you know. <sighs> and then you shake yourself and say, wait a minute. <clears throat> you know, you walk around and you get more steady. <laughs> you you go, for, go to the kitchen to make your coffee or whatever, right? Mm -hmm. All this is happening. All this is happening. And then an hour passes by or once the coffee gets in there inside the system, espresso duo, latte. <laughs> He or she is feeling fine and alert now, you see. And the knowing of the knower continues. The Keval Darshan, absolute vision, continues. Hmm? Yes. Por la mañana a veces nos despertamos, este... Todos, Shuda, Germán, Marcela... Y, y no estamos este, como muy conectados, ¿no? Este, y es como que nos sacudimos y vamos a la cocina, nos servimos un café o lo que desayunamos y, y está sucediendo que el café entra al sistema. Este, y cuando el café entra al sistema es como que estamos más, este, más alertas, tranquilos, centrados. Y entonces el, el conocedor es... es eh, de, de, del que Valdarsan de la visión sucede simultaneously there is also the knowledge aha you know instead of going to bed at 10 or maybe 10.30 or 11pm last night this one went to bed at 1.30 <laughs> so You know, and this, all of this thing is known, you see. Seen, known. seen, seen. And, uh, hmm? Yes. Mm -hmm. eh, el, el conocimiento, ¿no? De que, por ejemplo, a la noche, a, a, vamos a dormir algunos a las diez, diez y media, once, ayuda a la una y media, y todo esto es observado, todo esto es visto. When things and events don't happen according to promises made by others or, you know, your expectations, then the Agna comes in. Scientific, circumstantial evidence. Evidence says are lacking or missing. That is why it is not happening. 
No. Just evidences have to have. Yes. A veces las cosas este, no suceden como, como esperábamos, ¿no? O, o como habíamos hablado, con, no suceden y no suceden por otros. Entonces mis expectativas este, se, se frustran, pero entonces es como que las acnas vienen y, y podemos ver cómo suceden las evidencias. Mm -hmm. Anila, what is needed now, Anila, my dear? Hola, Anila. Good morning. Bon dia. Bon... <laughs> All right. Yes. She says only Agnes. Only Agnes. Yes. Hello, Agnes. Only Agnes. Yeah, I think this group is absolutely convinced. Only Agnes. Right, Marcela? Only Agnes. Este grupo está convencido que es solo Agnes. Es así, Marcela. Yeah, only Agnes. It's uh, it's like as if you have, as if like we as a group, you know, have made a very long journey. And we have reached the kingdom of heaven, okay? I mean, everybody knows the kingdom of heaven. Or we have reached a fantastic new land, new area, you know, kingdom of heaven. And we just kind of stop and say, hey, hey, what do I do now? <laughs> what do I do now? <laughs> what else is there? <laughs> so that is so that I would say, go, 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 enjoy. And be. Be where you are. Don't try to go back in this old world of yours. You're here. You're here. You want heaven? It's right here. You want heaven? It's right here. Oh, nosotros como grupo hicimos un, un largo viaje y hemos llegado al reino del paraíso, ¿no? Es un lugar tan fantástico y maravilloso y nuevo. Nuevo espacio, una nueva área. Y, y, y paramos y decimos, bueno, ¿y ahora qué más? Ella dice, entren, entren y disfruten y sean, sean. Yeah. Y estamos aquí. You see, before there were all of these beliefs, you know, before there were these beliefs that if I, I just have to wait for heaven to come, if I do this, I will be rewarded with heaven. I will go to heavens. And now this new definition of heaven is here right now. Right now. In perfection. Your right here is heaven through these, through these, and any one of this, Agnas, nothing, any one of this Agnas, you know. Hmm? Antes, este, esperábamos el paraíso. Eh, antes era ir al paraíso, y ahora. Entendemos, sabemos que el paraíso está aquí en perfección. Estamos aquí en el paraíso a través de cualquiera de las acnas. 
Um, did I speak to you about the priest in Kenya last time? Yes. Yes, I good. think so. Yes, yes, good. Okay, because <laughs> yeah, you know, I was with the Brazilians yesterday, and there was different. So I okay, so that's been covered. You see, or well, those. Okay. Sorry, go on. If you want to 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 repeat it. No, I don't want to repeat it, it be, except in a different way. Yes. And in a different way, those human beings, 145 of them, believers, believers, simple black citizens of Kenya with hardly any education but a lot of faith through imported <clears throat> Christian missionary work over 100 years, you see. The missionaries where they have been taught to love Jesus, love Jesus. You see? And they believed. They believed anybody who spoke about the Lord. See, they believed. And they were told that if you stop eating, you will meet, you will go to his kingdom where the Lord will be there. You see? And they refuse food. Is this right or is this wrong? Nobody knows. But they were looking for heaven. And if you meet Jesus, what would be the why would you want to meet him? If you meet him physically, what would be the what would you get from him? Yes. Eh, es, es una esto cuenta que hay 45 misioneros eh, creyentes en Kenia eh, que eran simples personas negras este, eh, había 45 personas que eran creyentes y había unos misioneros que les fueron enseñando que les enseñaron el amor a Jesús y ellos creyeron y a quienes le hablaban de, del Señor y le decían por ejemplo que si no comías este, ibas a ir al reino de Dios eh, si no comías entonces, y que ibas a recibir su comida y esto es correcto o es erróneo nadie sabe pero ellos buscaban el paraíso y lo buscaban y si lo encontraban ¿qué es lo que encontraban? Mm -hmm. Some of the ones will say you will enter into the world of the eternal mm -hmm. you know, eternal life for whosoever believes in him will attain eternal life, eternal life, and the others will perish, the others will die. You see? Yes. You know, okay, go on. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Dice, dice que si entras al, al, al reino de, del eterno, eh, vivirás. Esto es para los que creen. Y para los que no creen, los eh, morirán. Sí. 
Uh, they, you know, I, this, uh, and the reason I'm coming to do this is because I was a little boy in Kenya when I was, it was because I was born there, you know. And we, Fudo was young. I mean, I, you know, must be 11, 12, you know, years old. And we, I, we were all playing. in a town called Eldoret, which is in the highlands of Kenya, Eldoret, beautiful place. Uh, and, they, you know, there were 10, 12 boys, we were all playing, all of a sudden, all of a, sudden a, a car moves in our area and come out of the car, uh, a gentleman, a white man, <clears throat> steps out and he says, you boys want to come with me? I will give you some very nice, you know, come, come with me. I will I'll, we'll give you some very nice gifts, you know, nice things. Oh, you know, we were playful, so we jumped into his car. We all went with him, you know. He took us to his home and uh, then he started talking about, he said a few things about, for God so loved this world. You know, the standard sentences of the Bible. Hmm? He made us repeat them, you know. And then very short, you know, just a very short. And then he came out with some very beautiful white chocolates, you see. And he offered to each one of us, you know. At that time, we didn't understand, but, you know, we had the chocolates. And he says, then he brought us back to our, you know, where we were playing, and he left, you see. He did not, to my knowledge, he did not speak to any one of our mothers or parents before doing this, you see. <clears throat> yes. Dice Shuta que de pequeño, él nació en Kenia y cuando tenía alrededor de 11, 12 años estaba jugando con sus amigos. Él nació en Eldora, que es en tierras altas en, en Kenia, un lugar muy hermoso, y estaba jugando con, con otros niños y de repente entró un auto en el área donde ellos estaban y salió un hombre blanco y les dijo, los invitó a que vayan con él, que le daría cosas lindas, y los llevó a todos a su, cosa, a su casa y les habló del amor de Dios, palabras de la Biblia cortas, este, y luego vino con chocolates y se los ofreció. Luego los cargó de nuevo al auto y los llevó de nuevo a donde estaban antes jugando. Pero este hombre no le pidió permiso a los padres, no habló con nadie para llevarse a los niños con él. No, you know, I, from our, yours and mine, you, now we understand this as it is, you see. It is this human desire and drive to, to share the beauty of what you believe, you see. You know, in other words, whatever you believe, if you find it lovely, beautiful, and whatever, you know, you want to share it, you see. You say, yes, you want to share your beliefs, you see. If you have read the Bible, you know the Bible. If the church is sending you to say, all of these people in black Africa, they are primitives, they don't know anything, go teach them, you go help them, you know. The intentions are very good. Intentions are very good, we're helping. But it is associated with this with this 
transference of belief. You cannot transfer belief, you see. Hmm? Yes. Entendemos ahora nosotros que el deseo de este hombre era compartir lo bello de, de sus creencias y las quería compartir. De hecho, la iglesia es como que los, eh, los envía a, a que enseñen eh, eh, a que enseñen esto. Este, las intenciones eran buenas, estaban y, pero estaban asociadas con transferir sus creencias, pero verdaderamente no se pueden transferir las creencias. Well, you know, and other she simply says, this is how the world is. There is no one to be blamed. You see, this is, everybody gets different roles when one person is a priest or a mullah, a kind of a, one person is a Christian priest or a, uh, another one is a Muslim, uh, a man of God, or another one is a Muslim Hindu man of God, so-called men of God. I, I am coming to give you the message of the God because what you understand is not correct. So you see, the the position themselves as the middle man, I will lead you to God. I will lead you to God, you see. No human being can be led by anyone else to God. It has, it arises from internal experiences only, you see. Hmm? Eh, Dada dice, así es el mundo y no hay culpables. Este, hay sacerdotes cristianos, musulmanes, hombres hindúe, hindúes, este, eh, todos ellos son hombres de Dios. Este, porque que dicen que lo que tú entiendes no es lo correcto. Yo te llevaré a Dios. Y no se trate de que alguien te lleve a Dios. Todo esto tiene que ver con un eh, con, con eh, inter, inter, eh, experiencias internas. Mm, yeah, I mean, the simple question is, how can you lead anyone to God? And this is not a criticism, and I'm talking in general now. You know, how can you lead anyone to God when you really don't know who who or what God is, <laughs> or where he is. How can you lead anyone to God when you really do not know? You do not know what God is. Is God in a book? Is God in a book? Dice, ¿cómo puede, cómo puede alguien guiarte a Dios si no sabes dónde está? ¿Está en un libro Dios? Yes, God is in a book for 95% of the people of this world. That is, uh, that is how it is, you see. Includes, includes the Church of England or the Church of... And, the, you know, everything. That's on the big days, on the very special days, they talk about God and sing about God. It's, it's, it's fine. But that is how it is, you see. For the very special ones. And you and I have been through all of this, life after life after life. We are now lifted. We are now lifted in the exact vision of and of the God, in the exact experience of what every human being is really yearning for, seeking, searching, you see. Hmm? El 95%, para el 95% del, de los seres humanos, Dios está en un libro, y todas las iglesias hablan, de, hablan cantan de, sobre Dios. Y, y así es, pero para... 
para, los para el algunos, para los especiales, para nosotros. Ya pasamos por esto vida tras vida. Y ahora hemos sido elevados a la exacta visión, a la exacta experiencia del Lord. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Now, uh, okay, that, let's move on to a little lighter note. I know this is heavy topic, especially because, you know, all of this is happening. In, but, you know, we cannot move away from it. We have to face it in the name of the Lord and in the name of religion. There has been more blood shed on this beautiful earth of ours, you know. Rivers and rivers of blood, you see, and it continues to be the case, you see, yeah. in the name of religion. Yes. Eh, todo esto es este lo que eh, está sucediendo. Y hemos visto que en nombre de Dios, eh, en nombre de la religión, eh, se ha corrido, hemos visto ríos y ríos y ríos de sangre. Todo esto en nombre de la religión. Um, yes, so now the next heading, mm, the next heading is the experience of separation. Mm? It's the experience of separation. So the other, it's just one, two, three, four, five lines only. There is just the other speaking only, all right? Uh, mm -hmm. el, el próximo encabezamiento es la experiencia de la separación. Y hay unos cinco renglones que da habla. Uh, and the other, she says... Discharge cannot be stopped by anyone. What you see of ours, what you see of Ambalal Patel, what you see of Aim Patel and the Gnani Purush, uh, that also is discharging form. This is discharging form. This one is discharging form. It is discharging, this one. You see, in other words, this black cap, this gorgeous roses garland, this coat, everything that is visible of A.M. Patel and also the Gnani Purush because the Gnani Purush is, is also visible because he is in satsang. He says it's discharging. Ours too is discharging. But the only difference is you cannot remain. You, and he's speaking to Mahatmas, you all cannot remain like us. Remain like us means, he says, you know, so you go, let's go sentence by sentence. Watch, uh, oh. Um. El, el título es Experiencia de la Separación y da, dice, la descarga no puede ser detenida por nadie. Y ustedes pueden ver a M. Patel, pueden ver al Nani Purush, y eso es solamente una descarga. Puedes ver al Nani en la imagen que Yuda mostró, con su sombrero, con su saco, con su guirnalda de hermosas rosas, pero eso también es una descarga. Eh, y dice, ustedes no pueden permanecer como nosotras, como nosotros. Y aquí le está hablando a los Mahatmas. Mm -hmm. I'm giving you this exact sentences now, so let me just type it. Hmm. Uh, mm. You see, uh, it says... <clears throat> But you will not be able to remain like us. You will not be able to be like us. You are, all of us, it's discharging. Everything is discharged. Arman is discharging. Shuddha is discharging. Luz is discharging. Patricia is discharging. 
and we are discharging too. But you will not be able to remain like us because we have the we have we Nani Purush Dada Shri and Dada Bhagwan, you know, Dada Bhagwan in him, you know, but he says we, I, you know, he says we. Here he uses for we he uses Gnani Purush Dada Shri. We have <clears throat> Spasht Anubhav, Spasht Anubhav, and I've written what Spasht Anubhav means. Clear and distinct experience of the self. Clear and distinct experience of the self. Surya Mapura, I'm absolute Amapura, but Spasht, as clear as it can be. <clears throat> That's the difference. We have, we don't have that experience, you see. Clear and distinct experience of the self, you see. Hmm? <clears throat> eh, Dada dice, usted, hablándole los Mahatmas, no, no, no pueden ser como nosotros. Cuando se refiere a nosotros, se refiere a, al Nani Purush y y Dada Bhagwan, ¿no? En él. Y todo lo que todo lo que se ve, todo, todo es descarga. Es descarga en Germán, en Suda, en Luz, en Patricia. Y ¿por qué no podemos ser como ellos? ¿Por qué no, pueden, eh, no podemos permanecer como ellos en la clara eh, distinción? de la experiencia del ser. Yo soy absoluta alma pura. Es tan claro, eh, de una forma tan clara y permanente. Sí, um, there is, there is some very powerful sentences coming up in this. Say, I'm not complete, I'm not completed this... Uh... Uh, this five, six lines translation yet. So let me, I just gave it to you a little bit more. You see, <clears throat> this is for the first time in our satsang in, today, in this series of uh, our moment, our flight in space. Okay. We are coming across this word, these two words, spashta, Anubhav, spasht anubhav, spasht, clear, absolutely clear, anubhav, experience, you see. And so we want to spend some time ab uh, talking about it. In these words of Dadashri, it, there is... In these words of Dada Shri, there exists the answer. <laughs> there exists the definition of this clear and uh, uh, direct experience of the self. <clears throat> yes. Eh, nosotros estamos como en, en un viaje en, en el espacio y habla de dos palabras una es spatched que es eh, claro uh, yeah claro y... oh, let me I just stop there because you're, you're you know I just want to your since you're I just want to give you I just want to know whether it's you will be able to say spashta spashta great spashta. great wonderful spashta spashta <laughs> Spashta. I, I, it's, it's, you know, and, and I, I give pay attention to it because it's a very fantastic word, spashta. Spashta means all curtains, all curtains have been removed. All curtains have been removed and it's become crystal clear clarity. Is there, which is my vision. This is my vision. This is how the vision that 
I have infinite vision, but this was blocking it. I see, this was blocking it. And, and now it's pushed, uh, you know, pushed to away. Then the other sometimes can. Uh, Spashed Anubhav is also Spashed Anubhav or oh, interesting. Okay, we'll take it step by step. There is the word Spashed Anubhav. Uh, let me finish giving you this. Uh, of separation. Okay, the Spashed Anubhav of the Spashed, the clear and distinct experience, the clear and distinct direct experience of the self. Of separation, of experience of the self means what? Separation. Experience of the self means separation. You see, can not remain continuously for you all, each one of us. You see, that's what Dada is trying to say. Mm -hmm. Yes. Um... Spashta, eh, spashta es cuando todas las cortinas fueron removidas. Entonces puedo ver con absoluta claridad y puedo tener mi visión. Si antes no tenía la visión es porque estas cortinas no habían sido removidas. Y Nubao es eh, la experiencia. En estas palabras Dada, en estas palabras de Dada está la respuesta y la experiencia del ser es la separación y no puede y es como que no podemos permanecer en, en esta separación todo el tiempo. Es un magnificent sentence is coming out and the last sentence is and let me give it to you and this is Dadashri says it cannot remain for you because I have I have placed you all in the lift. I made you all enter into the lift, you know, Akram elevator lift. It's, I don't know what you call in your language, elevator or lift, you see, you just, I've placed you all in the lift, whereas mine is this discovery of infinite previous lifetimes, <laughs> infinite lifetimes. Mine is the discovery. He doesn't say mine. I, I, this is something that I have invented. Is there a difference between the word invent something and discover something, you see? Uh -huh. to, in, to invent something means it's something you're making new out of it. Whereas to discover something means you just remove, you know, you dig out the dirt, you dig out the dirt, and there is the pure gold down there, you see? You dig out uh -huh. the gold, you see? So you've discovered it, you know? Hmm, beautiful. Uh -huh. mm. Uh -huh. eh, la dada dice este por qué no puedes permanecer este si yo a todos los 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 bendije en el acram en, en eh, los elevé en el acram este y esto yo tardé infinitas vidas en, en descubrirlo y hace la, la, la distinción con inventar nosotros podemos inventar algo pero es como que hay una acción Y, y Dada, después de infinitas vidas, él descubrió eh, esto, ¿no? Y, y descubrir es como cavar y quitar la tierra y encontrar oro. Él lo descubrió luego de infinitas vidas. I'll wait until uh, our dear Marcela types up this last uh, sentence. Mm, yeah. Um, and then we go a little bit deeper into it, okay? <laughs> right. Yeah, so we go deeper into this. Ah, new words. Spashta. 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 Okay. Uh, means clear and distinct okay and uh, clear and distinct clear and distinct claro claro absolute claro <laughs> <laughs> yes clear and distinct right mm? 
esta que, que es pasta es de claro y, y, y absolutamente claro y transparente And now let's put an A in front of a spush. Entonces vamos a poner una A ahora frente a spasta. A spasta. A spasta means, ah, oh, that's the con that's that's where we are at right now. We have I since we got the Gnanvi, they we all Entered into the experience of the Amapura, so Amapura, but it has got the curtains of the discharging effects. Your discharge, your discharge, our discharging effects, discharging karma, file, whatever you want to call it. Is covering it, the file. You're here now. Now you're here. Before you were here. Oh, this I. So yeah, I am also Gabi. Oh, by God, I'm Gabi. Sure, I'm Gabi. <laughs> now you're, now, now you're here. Now what is left is, is all discharging files, karma, whatever you want to call it. Hmm? Aspashta. Bueno, Ashpasta es, nosotros pensamos en, en, que con el Nanvide entramos en la experiencia del alma pura, pero, de, pero todavía están las cortinas, las cortinas son la descarga de, de los efectos, del karma, del file, de, de lo, cómo lo querramos llamar. Debido a esas cortinas todavía no podemos tener... Eh, la clara visión del alma pura, experiencia del alma pura. So, so the spasht, I know, wow, I'm, the, the clear and distinct experience, experience of the self. And there's another word, which I'm sure you have heard, you know, because you're in so much satsang, spasht, Yeah. We then, you see, we then. Yeah. Anubhav is to experience it and we then. We then. <clears throat> They are very close. Both of these are very close. Spashta we then and Spashta Anubhav. But there is this. this we are going in very, very fine slices. We then. Spashta clear we So, uh, Vedan, now how do I tell you about Vedan? Mm -hmm. The scriptures of, and I, you talk about that once a long time ago. Well, when we said Spash, oh, yeah. yeah, the we know, when we were discussing, we, when, when we were uh, translating the Charan Vidhi, the Arati, you see, Arati of Dada and uh, our. Dear uh, <clears throat> Simander Swami, when we were uh, translating, you know, Cho Chothi Arati Dadani Aditatap Kare. Dada Dita Tapakare Gnana Agna. You know, I'm, I'm, I don't want to mix the line. Swa Sambedana Shakti. Swa Sambedana Shakti. This word is Sambedan, you see. I am the you know the the words samvedan svedan samvedan uh samvedan sam okay vedan 
Vedan means to know. Veda. Veda means to know. You see? And Veda no, means also to suffer. Uh, you see, uh, you know, I mean, uh, that, and then Vedana, uh, this is where Vedana is pain signals, you see. Uh, you know, if you're if your tooth is hurting, you'll say, oh, my, I, my, you know, the pain signals are going and you are saying, oh, I'm having a lot of Vedana or pain. So this neighbor is experiencing this pain. Sva some Vedan, the, uh, the, the self is knowing the self is knowing more of the self. Sva sam vedan. You see, uh, there is this knowing part and suffering part of Fabi, um, Anila, and then there is the knowing of the knower which continues. As an energy, you see, it continues as an energy of the self, Sva Samvedan Shakti. You see, it's called Sva Samvedan Shakti. Hmm? Um... En la palabra Veda, en este, lo, hay, hay una canción en, en el Charandiji, en el arte de Dada, que cantó Suda, y Veda es eh, conocer. Y Vedana es también sufrir algún señales de dolor, ¿no? Entonces hay gente que dice, tengo Vedana, y eso le pasa a Gaby, a... a, 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 a todos, ¿no? Pero, pero permanece... Eh, el, el conocimiento del conocedor Sua mm -hmm. Sanveda Shakti It's a Shakti, it's a magnificent Shakti This is actually our energy your energy and my energy When somebody says Stupid Ogabi, get out from here You see Two things happen Either there is suffering in Gabi Or the inside knower arises higher in separation, you see. Arises higher in separation. Not goes towards Gavin and says, what, me? Your, your mother is like this, your father is like this, you see. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Nikal. No, well, not in the Nikal yet. Nikal happens when you don't. Nikal is the energy that arises. Nikal happens when Gabi remains. Do not answer. Yes, yeah, still, still, absolutely still. Yeah, yeah. it's not. A, it's not up to Gabi to remain still yeah. or not still. Gabi might still do this, but you inside are not moved. Mm -hmm. You see? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Gabi may yeah. punch him. Ma Gabi may slap him, you see? You know? But that is... You need to know in exactness what, where you are and who you are. And, you know, and then comes a time when you don't even... You don't get affected at all. We've talked about it before, you know. Nothing. Yes, yes. That is the Sva Samvedan Shakti. Sva Samvedan Shakti. So these words of the Aarti, you know, these words of the Aarti, <laughs> you know, 
are very, very precious. Very precious. Both the artists. Hmm? Y bueno, entonces, este, por ejemplo, en nuestra energía, este, si alguien le dice a Gaby estúpida, ella puede pasar dos cosas. Una, que, que se quede en el sufrimiento. Y otra, que surge el conocedor interno en separación y no le conteste. Y, y, y no le conteste. Y estas palabras, este, eso a Sanveda Shakti, son preciosas. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, and uh, if you look at it, and I'm just uh, looking at the Chiran Vidhi and the Narthi of Tada Bhagwan. And I'm trying to get to the source of Vedan Shakti, you see? Mm. Acá dice que si miras este, el arte de Dada Bhagwan, acá lo está buscando Suda, el Swam Sambeda Shakti. Yeah, it's, uh, it's also probably, you know, it's the same energy is written in different, different directions, you see, different, different ways, you see. Mm -hmm. Yes, uh-huh. En nuestra versión es en la última oración de la página 28, que está justo lo que él está diciendo. What, what are you saying, my dear, in English? In our last version of Charambidi, mm -hmm. in page 28, is write that sentence. Yeah, but uh, where is this? Uh, Why the what? Are you what? Which which? Where exactly is it? You know, this is what I want to. RT of the other one. Yes, yes, right. Yes, this. One, two, three, four in the five. Yeah. Five. Panchi me tirthankar. Uh, but why don't you read the whole thing? Yeah, right. There it is. Three G RT Dada. It's the third RT. I wanted to know the third RT. And it essentially says, Triji Arti Dadani Kevadagnan Pames. It's in the absolute knowledge. You see, the third Arti of Dada gives you absolute, it, you know, it leads you to absolute knowledge. The third Arti of Dada is absolute knowledge. And this absolute knowledge is associated with so some way shakti brahmand prakashya swayam in other words this absolute knowledge is this is part of this pashta vedan is part of this spashta vedan the clear and distinct experience of the self you see third arti of dadani yes Triji Arti Dadani Kevad Gnan Pame. In other words, the third Arti of Dada is reaches or takes this one all the way up to absolute knowledge, you know. And this our entire series of such songs is to take us there. Absolute knowledge, you see. Kevad Gnan Purna. Tva, purna, tva, full, full. So, the yes, Triji, yeah. me, mm -hmm. sorry, yeah, sorry, 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 go on. Sorry, this, I forgot about you. I'm is, trying to. Is, uh, is, is uh -huh. not easy, this, this understanding. Mm -hmm. este, estas energías son, son diferentes y este, este arte eh, surge y te eleva al conocimiento absoluto que está asociado. Eh, con el Spashta Veda, el, el absoluto conocimiento, Purnutu, Purnutua. Yes, it's Kevel Gran, it's absolute knowledge. You see, third Arti of Dada, this is, as I've mentioned to all of you before in the Arti sessions, you see, this is, this is really, this all represents the Arti, 
the absolute worship and the moment of the awakened one, the Mahatma, of the awakened Mahatma, he is just awakened to the absolute one. You see, by the worship of, by the worship of the absolute one, Dada Bhagwan inside, 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 you see. It's that internal moment that is part of this Purnatva, the moment inside, all the way up, you know. Hmm? Go on. Eh, es el, el que valdan es, es este arti no para los mahatmas que recién recibieron que recién están despiertos en este camino a, al, al ser absoluto es el, el trabajo interno de dada este eh, el, el momento interno el que nos eleva and in this particular sentence and you know this is this this was some way then the uh, the effortless the effortless process of the knower. that I am, the effortless process of the knower that I am is associated with an energy that pulls me higher, higher in the sense that it really keeps me above, keeps me above all of this stuff that we talked about happening to Gabi, you see, or to me or you, you know. This is the Swasam Vedan, the knower rises to such level through an energy that is within, is of the self, energy of the self that, that absolutely uh, keeps you unaffected, you see. There is no reaction. There's not even the slightest reaction. What, me? You're telling me? You know, no slightest reaction. So some Vedan Shakti it is called. It is really the energy of the self. You cannot get that energy from anywhere else outside. You cannot get that energy from Gavi. Gavi will say, oh, I'm... I'm not going to say anything. I'm a Mahatma. I will never say anything. Well, <laughs> it's not inside Gavi. It is, it is inside Gavi, but it is inside you, not in the Gavi complex. You understand? That's what I'm trying to say. It is Swa, Samvedan, and that is very clearly related to this clear and distinct experience of the self that Dada is talking about, Spashta Vedan. <clears throat> and we came to this word Vedan, we, you know, it just kind of triggered off this Arti word, you know, Sva Sam Vedan. You see, Sva Sam Vedan. Uh, it means. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Swasam Vedan es sin esfuerzo, es, un, es el proceso del conocedor eh, que soy y se asocia con una energía que me eleva y me mantiene más allá de lo que le suceda a Gaby. Es la energía del ser que absolutamente me mantiene sin ser afectada o tener re reacción alguna, ni la más mínima. La energía del ser no está dentro de Gaby, porque Gaby es el complejo del cuerpo, mente y habla. Es la energía del ser que está, es la energía del ser. Eh, y eso es este... Eh, Swa Samba Vedan. 
Swa samvedan. Swa, you know, there's this swa means self, okay? Swa, we all know, it means self. And and the opposite is para. Para means, para means the not the self, not the self, comma, the other, you know, the other. Hmm? Comma, the non-self, you see? Hmm? That, see this swa par, swa par, we need to know this. Swa par. Swa, swa, par, par. Swa, swa and par, par, par is loose. Par is loose. Par is Marcela. Par is Laura. Swa. Y par, par. no mm. es el ser. Es luz, es Marcela, es mm -hmm. Patricia. Mm -hmm. No es el ser. So, par, what do you say? Uh, you say swa means yo. <laughs> Now, what is par mean? What do you say par? Uh, Marcela, what is par? ¿Qué es par, Marcela? Marcela es par. Uh, oh, oh, you, you, I, I, I see you writing swa, yo. So, what is par? No, el no ser. El no ser. No, no ser. yo. No, no yo. Ser. Oh, no, no, yeah, no yo. Okay, no yo. <laughs> <laughs> no yo. <laughs> no yo. All right. No, no yo. <laughs> no yo. <laughs> Gabi, stupido, no yo, no yo, <laughs> not you, you see, in other words, it is going to Laura, Gabi, Shuta, it's not going to Swa, cannot touch the Swa, how can these palabras, these words, and which create world wars, okay, words create world wars, you see, For in the history of man, All wars have started because of words. <laughs> Mine, <laughs> not yours. Mine. <laughs> Mine. Eh, to, to, todas, las, eh, todas las guerras han comenzado con, con las palabras. Este, y las palabras vienen de, del no ser. So, so some maiden. Okay, so now, what do you say? Um, Oh yeah, I you know I have given you this word. Um, let me give, let me look at my translation there. Oh, before, uh, yeah, and I don't want to search it. I'll just you know. The other she says, and I have to say this in Gujarati so then you can get it in exactness. Pratyaksh chuta panano anubhav amara jevo tamne na rahe. This Pratyaksh, 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 all of you know. Pratyaksh Tada Bhagwan Shakshi, right? We say that, right? Pratyaksh. What is Pratyaksh? Okay, Pratyaksh. Pratyaksh, right? What is Pratyaksh? Um, anyone? Pratyaksh? What is, you know, you, sabe lo que es pratyaksh? you know, we Say this every day in our Charan Vidhi. Pratyaksh Dada Bhagavan Nisakshi. Vartamane Mahavidek Shetrama Vicharta Shri Simandar Swami Ne Atyan Bhakti Purok Namaskar Karu. Should we say that? Pratyaksh Pratyaksh Pratyaksh. What is Pratyaksh? Okay, Pratyaksh. Lo vemos siempre. Okay, so. Living presence. Yeah, that is correct. Presence in the presence, but actually in the living presence, that is Pratyaksh means, the exact meaning of Pratyaksh means in front of my eyes. Pratyaksh. Right now, you and I are Pratyaksh. Yeah, I mean, obviously Zoom, but you know, But this is as good as it gets until you and I meet, say, in New York or, I mean, say, in USA or in South America. But, you know, that is the exact pratyaksha. You're now exactly in front of the bodies. You know, my eyes can see you right there in three dimensions, right? That is pratyaksha. I can see that, you see? Uh -huh. Uh, in front of my eyes. And then this pratyaksh is a very pratyaksh darshan. That means we call it live darshan, right? Live darshan. 
pratyaksh darshan of the gnani which all of you will have uh, later on in, in a, you know in, soon you will be having it in in sao paulo you know so pratyaksh live darshan hmm? Now, mm, bueno, pra, pratyash mm. es en, en frente de mis ojos, ¿no? Es eh, eh, ver en, en tres de mis dimensiones. Y el pratyash darshan es lo que vamos a hacer en, pronto en San Pablo. Yeah, now, this is it. now, you notice that I put the words eyes in inverted commas, right? Hmm? Mm -hmm. no, there is okay. a reason. Yeah, there is a reason because... That darshan, that darshan shifts higher and higher away from these physical eyes, you see. Everybody understands this darshan. And, and so the higher you rise, this word pratyaksh dada bhagwan ni sakshi, you know, now you're saying... You know, of course, when we, Sarish and I translated this way back, oh, you know, we ourselves have gone through a lot of revisions inside, you know, Pratyaksh. In other words, maybe initially said with Dada Bhagwan as my witness, <laughs> you know, you know. And then we, we say, then we said, well, I said, no, 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 we, Dada Bhagwan within me as a witness, you know. <laughs> and then, uh, then you do not have to even say with Dada Bhagwan because when you say, hey, Dada Bhagwan, I'm sorry I'm going too long, but when you say, hey, Dada Bhagwan, hey, Dada Bhagwan, you know. Uh, when you say, hey, Dada Bhagwan, hmm, is a, a direct appeal of Darshan. You see, uh, when you say, hey, Dada Bhagwan, it is the highest appeal of, of a human being. Hey, Dada Bhagwan, I'm talking about highest appeal of a Mahatma is is an highest internal appeal inside to the Absolute Lord, to the Absolute Lord within him, you know. Hey, Dada Bhagwan, you know. It is, you know, it's, it's, it begins, it, 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 this Hey, Dada Bhagwan begins in every sentence of the, of the Navakalam. Hmm? Yes. Eh, eh, cuando dice que practish, eh, practishya es en, en frente de mis ojos. Pratyaksh. 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 Eh, de... <laughs> I'm sorry. Pratyaksha. <laughs> All right, yeah. Eh, Pratyaksha. Eh, en frente de mis ojos, en, en tercera dimensión, cuando se refiere a los ojos, está puesto entre paren, entre comillas, se refiere a los ojos este, más elevados, ¿no? los ojos de Endarshan, es, es que te elevan, y cuanto más elevado estás, este, eh, más elevada es, es tu visión. Entonces, por ejemplo, al principio decimos este, dada como, como testigo, luego decimos... Eh, Dada, dada en mí y, y luego ya no lo decimos decimos hey dada y es este, la más directa y elevada eh, pedido ¿no? para dentro para, el, para dada Bhagwan para su ser absoluto de dada Bhagwan y, y todas las oraciones en los nueve escalam con, comienzan con hey dada Hey Dada Bhagwan, you see, that's hey, it. Dada Bhagwan. You know, if you look at the now columns, this thing is there. You know, you are not kind of appealing. You're not appealing to any external energy, are you? Cuando decimos Dada Bhagwan, no estamos apelando a ninguna energía externa. Yeah, and you know. 
an appeal means a serious urgent and or heartfelt request you see that's called serious urgent and heartfelt it's a serious it's urgent and it's heartfelt ho oh, dada it's not you know you cannot translate this hey into o oh. you know exactly. that's what i was thinking because i'm reading the charambidi in this moment and we are we say oh, oh and yeah. for us o oh is o oh. yeah but yeah 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 you're right i, I think yeah yeah, yeah. Sorry. yeah thank you Me because in realidad no es un 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 simple o oh. es es una invocación profundísima es la más profunda invocación que podemos hacer para tener esa conexión con Dada Bhagwan en el yeah, inicio uh -huh. de cada uno de los nueve calams. Yes, Entonces, it, this is... Ten en cuenta que ese O oh es mucho más que un O. Oh. Yeah, yeah, it's a wonder, out of wonder. Yeah, right. It's not a mucho, right. mucho business, okay? This mm -hmm. thing this thing is a highly urgent, highly urgent, highly special, and coming from the heart, the heartfelt request. Hey, Dada Bhagwan. You know, it says, hey, Dada Bhagwan. Hey, Dada Bhagwan. Oh, you know, hey, you know, we may in the next, uh, you know, may, Fabi, in your next uh, revision, or at least keep a note of this thing here in your Charanvidi, that it needs to be, it needs yes. to be incorporated. I don't know how to incorporate it in your language, but... We will, yeah. <laughs> we will get it, don't worry. Right. With Kimo yeah, so, and a lot yeah, of yeah, people. Yeah. Hey, Dada Bhagwan. People have to understand. Yeah, when a human being goes to the Lord, there is a reason. Every human being who runs to the Lord, whether it is in a church, mosque, synagogue, temple, there is a reason. He goes there with an heartfelt, urgent request, heartfelt appeal, you know. He kneels, says, My Lord. <clears throat> And the same is with Mahatmas now. Mahatmas, location of appeal, goes inwards. Goes inwards to the Dada Bhagwan, the Absolute One. Then throw the meme. That's correct inside me. You see? And Please, please, please grant me the energy never to hurt the ego of anyone, you know. I mean, this is an real appeal, you know. It's it's not it's not something. Hey, Dada Bhagwan, oh Dada, you know, it's not just something that you recite and just go move on to the next column. You can spend a whole lifetime understanding column number one of Nani Purush Dada Shri, you see. And that understanding comes through your own experiences. Right, Gabi? That understanding comes through your own experiences. Mm -hmm. este, el, 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 el pedido que hacemos, este, cuando decimos hey, da, da, no es en una forma automática o, o repetitiva, es algo que que, por ejemplo, las personas cuando van a la iglesia van a hacer un pedido y van a hacer un pedido porque algo les está sucediendo, es algo especial, serio, urgente, y es un pedido sentido desde el corazón. Bueno, well, we'll eh, no, so, yeah. Ok, es 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 algo muy sentido, no, 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 se, no se dice... Yeah. De la boca para yeah, yeah, yes. yeah, yes, yes, well, my dear. Take. Yeah, time flew very fast, but you know that's beautiful. If it flies in too at short, the, too at, short. The, <laughs> at the feet of Dada, it in the company of our dearest, dearest Dada, you know. Mm. Uh, so we'll be back ten minutes. Thank you, Marcela, Saint Patricia, everyone, ten and Fabi. Y yeah. Uh, Gracias. Yeah, we'll be back. Yeah. All Gracias. right. Uh, in the during this interval, I'm just going to give you a link about Hey Dada Bhagwan. Okay, I just kind of 
it kind of brought me back so i'll give it to you okay mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. you can you can watch it, watch it at your leisure mm -hmm. thank you Shada. yes Fabi, Fabi, sí, mi preciosa. <laughs> ¿Qué palabra crees que o Laura también, no? Ya, yeah, esa chita no podría tres. poner. Ah, pero se está grabando, Kimo. Lo hablamos ah. después porque se está grabando ah. el vale. satsang. Ya. Yeah. Yo también lo pensé, pero. <laughs> pero no. Ah, ok. Cande, si le compartís el sonido.
हे दादा भगवान मने कोई पण देहधारी जीवात्मा नो किंचित मात्र पण अहम न दुभाय न दुभावाय के दुभाववा प्रत्ये न अनुमोदाय एवी परम शक्ति आपो मने कोई पण देहधारी जीवात्मा नो किंचित मात्र पण अहम न दुभाय एवी सियादवाद वाणी सियादवाद वर्तन अने सियादवाद मनन करवानी परम शक्ति आपो हे दादा भगवान मने कोई पण धर्मनु किंचित मात्र पण प्रमाण न दुभाय न दुभावाय के दुभावा प्रत्ये न अनुमोदाय एवी परम शक्ति आपो मने कोई पण धर्मनु किंचित मात्र पण प्रमाण न दुभाय एवी सियादवाद वाणी सियादवाद वर्तन अने सियादवाद मनन करवानी परम शक्ति आपो हे दादा भगवान मने कोई पण देहधारी उपदेशक साधु साध्वी के आचार्य नो अवर्णवाद अपराध अविनय न करवानी परम शक्ति आपो हे दादा भगवान मने कोई पण देहधारी जीवात्मा पण मने कोई पण देहधारी जीवात्मा प्रत्ये किंचित मात्र पण अभाव तिरस्कार क्यारे पण न कराय न करावाय के करता प्रत्ये न अनुमोदाय एवी परम शक्ति आपो हे दादा भगवान मने कोई पण देहधारी जीवात्मा साथे क्यारे पण कठोर भाषा तंतिली भाषा न बोलाय न बोलावाय के बोलवा प्रत्ये न अनुमोदाय एवी परम शक्ति आपो कोई कठोर भाषा तंतिली भाषा बोले तो मने मृदु रुजु भाषा ओ बोलवानी शक्ति आपो हे दादा भगवान मने कोई पण देहधारी जीवात्मा प्रत्ये स्त्री पुरुष अगर न पुंसक गम्य ते लिंग धारी होय तो तेना संबंधी किंचित मात्र पण विषय विकार संबंधी दोषो इच्छाओ चेष्टाओ न कराय के विचार संबंधी दोषो न कराय न करावाय के करता प्रत्ये न अनुमोदाय एवी परम शक्ति आपो मने निरंतर निर्विकार रहवानी परम शक्ति आपो हे दादा भगवान मने कोई पण रसमा लुब्धपणु न कराय एवी शक्ति आपो समरसी खोराक लेवाय एवी परम शक्ति आपो हे दादा भगवान मने कोई पण देहधारी जीवात्मा नो प्रत्यक्ष अगर परोक्ष जीवन तगर मृत्यु पामेला नो कोई नोए किंचित मात्र पण अवर्णवाद अपराध अविनय न कराय न करावाय के करता प्रत्ये न अनुमोदाय एवी परम शक्ति आपो हे दादा भगवान मने जगत कल्याण करवानो निमित बनवानी परम शक्ति आपो शक्ति आपो शक्ति आपो जय सच्चिदानंद जय सच्चिदानंद जय सच्चिदानंद डब्ल्यू Oh, okay. So I noticed that you have already seen <laughs> this now yes. kalam. There was uh, that brought back the Hey Dada Bhagwan, you know. <clears throat> now, um, so this sentence pratyaksh chuta pani. This particular sentence, this word about. Um, so we were talking about pratyaksh it means in front of my eyes you see and then it just uh, 
all the way to you see so it's interesting in front of my eyes you all are in front of my eyes damian is front in front of my eyes gabi anila right i laura you are in front of my eyes right now look at me look at this thing here in the hand because I, how do i say it if this is the eye of the self of the self in front of my eyes is this world of damian shudha laura and then this eye goes within it goes inside and in that direction too what you see as the self is pratyaksha what you see as the self the awakened amapura the awakened pure soul is saying pratyaksha dada bhagwan ne sakshi is say in other words now my lord dada bhagwan you are no longer a concept you are no longer a belief you are no longer you are present you are i can see i it's not the seeing through here i see you i i experience you i know you you see so with, with, with you as my witness i send my namaskars to lord simander to the amapura within damian marcela etc right you can this the communication is entirely internal then it becomes an internal communication you see <coughs> bueno eh cuando decimos en en frente de mis ojos estamos en la de anila de laura y son los ojos del mundo pero con los ojos si vamos para adentro estamos viendo con los ojos del alma y en esa dirección lo que ves es el ser es el pratitya eh, es decimos mi lord dada bhagwan no eres un concepto no eres una creencia este, estás presente te veo te experimento te conozco mm -hmm. y contigo como mi testigo envío mis saludos así mandar a la alma pura de Damián de Gabriela es este inter, es la interna comunicación yeah. it's the, it's the direct and the it's next direct. thing and is next is direct direct and and the other has used these words I, you know I mean I over all these years not a single word of Dada is without meaning yes <laughs> is exact so dada shri says pratyaksh chhuta pana no anubhav amara jeevo tamne na rahi sake now you know pratyaksh chhuta pana it is i can it's a directly visible experience of separation it is a directly visible experience of separation you see that's what the other she is saying as directly visible experience of separation of separation is dadas is dadas and it is now big dada is because in everything dada is just like everything absolutely separated from am patel and also from the words that nani purush dada shri is speaking <laughs> you know 
what a magnificent state and that is called spasht vedan spasht vedan clear and distinct experience of the self is intrinsically and exactly related to the separated state it is a separation that is part of this separation that is part of this definition of spasht vedan or the clear and distinct experience of the self what does it mean when say i i am separate what does it really mean you know you know what do you mean by separate i'm separate well what is what is it really to mean Rada, eh, en, en esta directa comunicación, ¿no? las palabras de Dada tienen el significado exacto. Eh, y Pratishtista es directo, visible, es la experiencia de la separación. Es, es Dada, que está separado de Empatel, y inclusive hasta de las palabras de Nani Purush. Eh, Spantesh es eh, intrínseco, intrínseco al estado de separación. ¿Pero qué significa estar separado? Answer. You're done with this world. You're, you're out of it. You don't, you don't belong to this world. <laughs> uh, you're you you are in living moksha i you are in living moksha la respuesta es terminamos con el mundo no pertenecemos al mundo niruma would say vivimos el moksha niruma would say dada in zambia right you know in dada, dada was in zambia <clears throat> East, uh, you know, South East Africa, just well, south of East Africa, Zambia. Zambia and Zimbabwe were the new names, are the new names, uh, when, which is what called uh, Northern and Southern Rhodesia, you know, in uh, under the British colonies, you know. And so Zimbabwe, and other was there, Sirish took Dada there for satsang, you see, with the Indians there, the Indian businessmen. And Dada, you know, I mean, you're in a different country. It's not India, you know, it's sparsely populated country with a lot of land and farm, etc., few homes here and there, you know. And so, Niruma would say, Dada, Dada, I don't even ask, you know, at, at the last, you know, the, remind, you know, Dada, we have to get ready for satsang now. So, oh, is that right? Where are we going? <laughs> Dada would say, where are we going? You <laughs> say. So, you know, Niruma, which shout in his ears here and this and it's fine and then the time comes dada now time to go oh time to go now <clears throat> okay so dada would get up niruma would bring the shoes and the cap and the you know so he was like totally surrendered to the circumstances as they were coming through the words of Niruma. You see? Niruma says, Dada, we have to go here. Dada, we have to do this, etc., etc. Is absolutely separated. You know? <clears throat> Yes, the only yeah. time he really connects, the only time he really connects and descends from the Dada Bhagwan into Grani Purusha is when 
somebody asks a question. Mm. Or somebody is doing a vidhi, or somebody is doing a vidhi at his feet, you see? Mm. Mm. Yes. Mm -hmm. eh, la respuesta a qué significa estar separado, ¿no? Es, nosotros ya no pertenecemos a este mundo, estamos viviendo en Moksha y recuerda eh, Shuda que Shiri ya había llevado a Dada a, a la parte sudeste de África, a Zimbabue, donde hay muchas granjas, es un lugar muy grande, muy, muy popular, con mucha población. Y Niruma le dice a Dada este, que, que si está listo para el satsán. Y Dada pregunta, ¿dónde vamos? Eh, y Niruma le dice, bueno, ahora vamos a ir. Y, y le traía sus zapatos y le traía su sombrero. Y Dada estaba absolutamente entregado a las palabras de Niruma. Eh, absolutamente separado y solo conectaba cuando cuando alguien le hacía una pregunta a Nani Purush o cuando alguien hacía Vidi a sus pies another another part of his uh, satsang today with Dada you know and of course you already have the exact translation uh, of of this Five, la, five line satsang hmm? about the experience of separation. You see, the experience, it's, it's the most important. Uh, Sorry, should I may ask you a question? Mm -hmm, about yes. Mm -hmm. part? Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. Is that yeah. exactly the same with our Nani Purush, with, with Pushyasri? He's always in Dada Bhagwan and he only connects and becomes the Nani Purush when someone asks a question or someone is doing a vidi. Uh, not exactly. Uh, very close. Uh, part of the reason is he's still running a very huge organization. He is, you know, okay. they they you know they they come in and they they come in and ask him about a lot of things that are going on in terms of all the constructions of the temples and the disturb disbursements. You know, they clear it through him. There's nothing that happens without his knowledge, you see. So he is deeply involved in the organizational aspects of it too. There, you have to use your relative intellect, you see. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the, lo que know. le pregunté es si con nuestro actual Nani Purush era lo mismo, si solo se conectaba y bajaba al nivel de Nani Purush cuando alguien le hacía una pregunta o alguien le hacía, hacía un vídeo a sus pies, y no, en este caso no, porque él está dirigiendo una organización de tal tamaño y con construcción de templos y con todas esas cosas, que es necesario usar el intelecto relativo para llevar a cabo esas acciones. Thank you. The, the The answer is also in today's satsang, the spashtavedan, the clear and the distinct experience of the self in this very, uh, on this very earth of ours, is very unique of Dada Sri and cannot be matched by, by anything else, anyone else, because this is the discovery of the Gnani Purush, life after life after life after life. And in that process, <clears throat> he has liberated Niruma, Gnani, Deepak Pai, all of us. So he has placed us all in the lift. You see, placed us on the lift. Whereas for him, he doesn't need to enter the lift. He is already there. <laughs> you understand? That is the difference. You understand this? You know, so Niruma always used to say this Gnani, this Dada. Yes, Dada. Na bhuto na bhavishyati. In other words, there was never anyone like this Dada in the past, 
nor will there ever be anyone like him in the future. Yes. La exacta, ahora tenemos la exacta traducción en estas cinco líneas sobre la experiencia de la separación. Es, es, es Pashtan Vedan en este mundo es único y no puede ser comparado y el proceso y su proceso eh, Dada le dio este, esta, esta liberación a Ninuma a Deepak y, y, y nos puso a todos en el elevador y él no tenía que estar en el elevador porque él ya no tenía que entrar porque él ya estaba ahí y Niruma las palabras de Niruma es que nunca habrá Nunca hubo y nunca habrá alguien como él. Yeah. We all have received this knowledge. And being in the lift, you see, there was one sentence, you know. This, understand this direct, exact experience of separation. Yes, our... Gnani Deepak by Niruma are very, very close to it. They are rising through their own Purushar, their own exactness, exactness of their internal vision, you see. Uh, they are rising very, very high, very, very high, you know, compared to via Mahatmas, you see. But Dada, no puto na bhavishyati, never was in anyone. He himself says, after a million years, I'm coming, coming here, you know. And for centuries in the future, human beings will be exploring these words of his, like you and I have been exploring this morning, you know, exploring and rising, exploring and rising, you see? Hmm? Eh, el conocimiento eh, de que, que da a Dios y, y, y ponernos en y estar en, 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 el eleva, en elevados este de, de Niruma y de Nani Purusha actual me vienen por su propio Purushar y, y, y así surgió eh, tan grado tan, tan alta elevación para poder concebir a los Mahatmas y dada luego de millones de años vino y por siglos los seres humanos van a estar explorando sus palabras y a través de explorar sus palabras también van a ir Elevándose. I've, you know, this is a very interesting sentence. He says, you cannot have this experience uh, in the exactness. Uh, in the exactness means continuous. Continuous separation, you see. Continuous separation. Uh, Because I have placed you in the lift and in the elevator. And what does it really mean? Placed you in the elevator. That will accomplish the goal. And what is this elevator? Everybody say, what is this elevator? Answer. By Vagnas, you see. It's the elevator of the five agnas. Do not get out of it. It's like sticking your finger out of the elevator, you see. You know, it's B. You know, so in this agna vision, it, you don't have to do anything. In the agna vision, you just stand like you would in an elevator that is crowded. <clears throat> and, and when the time comes, it will make a sound. <laughs> And out you go on the 12th floor, you see. Well, in the next 
somewhere in this time in the future we will talk more about what does it mean different floors five six seven eight nine ten what are these floors you know Okay, should that move again? Yeah, I let, yeah. let me please. Yeah, please. Sure. yeah right. Um, yeah. Yes, uh -huh. uh, you can't have this experience of the continuous separation because I put you in the elevator and put you in the elevator, what does it mean? What will you get to your meta? Este, el elevador, el estar en el elevador es estar en las cinco agnas y no, saques, no salgas de allí, ni siquiera saques tu dedo. Y, y cuando llegue el momento, este, digamos, bueno, estás en el piso 12. Ahora vamos a hablar más adelante qué es esto de los diferentes pisos, 5, 6, 7, 12. Y también es zero doorship. Being in a lift means zero doorship. You see, the exact vision that is associated with flawlessness of everything that arises. There is, there is no doer there. Nobody is doing anything, you see. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Y, y estar en el elevador es también es las cinco agnas, cero hacedor, y todo el mundo es impecable. Yes, and in with reference to I don't know who asked the question about the Gnani and his uh, state. Was it you, uh, Fabi? Yes, Fabi. Oh, yes. Asked. Fabi. Yeah, in last Parayan, <clears throat> the Gnani came close to describing his own spashed Vedan or the clear and distinct experience. He described it in his words, difficult to understand for most people. <clears throat> Because you have to see it from the way he is seeing seeing it, you see. You have to kind of come. He let me say this he didn't describe it with the simple clarity that Dada is describing here, you know. In the ultimo parayam el nani este explicó su su propio proceso y es bastante difícil entender para, para casi todas las personas y ahora va a explicar algo sobre pues this these are all these are all talks about svasam vedan this are all this is all a matter of an internal internal experience that has no worldly equivalence, all right? It has not got any world equivalence, you see. Hmm? Eh, esto, todo esto se debe al Swar San Vedan, este, y es una experiencia interna que no tiene ninguna ex, eh, equivalencia con lo mundano. Yes, and in closing, my friends, today, I just want to give you something here. Uh, this is uh, the only reason I give you this particular link and pardon me for, you know, giving it to me or sharing it with you. Uh, one more link is because uh, of some amazing, unique, new experiences I shared with the group in Brazil, you see. So, you know, you, when you have time, for those of you who understand this English part and Portuguese, <laughs> which is very close to Spanish, you will you will get into it. Take a look at it. It uh, you know it. We are entering into a new world. You know, a new world that is beyond our uh, rooting vision. Shall I say that's it? Okay, you know. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, especially the translators, especially the translators need to go look at this satsang that I've just given you, okay? Bueno, acá también nos está pasando un link que es este único y es una experiencia que tuvo con con los satsang de Brasil, este que no tiene nada que ver con la rutina mundana. Yeah. I was amazed at what came through. You know what what arose, you know, we started with, you know, they, they are behind you. They are all behind you by 30 pages on the same, <laughs> same journey of 
Purnatva, you know, <laughs> they're, they're behind because you get two per week, whereas they get only one, you know. But whatever it is, there's something interesting that came out. It might be worthwhile for you to kind of check out, you know. Hmm? All right? Y quedó sorprendido Shuda por lo que surgió. A pesar de que están tres sesiones atrasados, pues nosotros tenemos dos veces por semana. Este, y, y quiere que lo, que lo compartamos. Official that no yeah. Okay. Uh -huh. Yes. Yes. Can you please upload this session because I missed the first part. Yeah, um, I will do that. Yeah, I will do that. Hmm? Yes, yeah. we'll do that. This one, this one also, I tell you, five, six lines, and it just gets you into a different world. You know, I mean, you know, this, so yeah, right. I mean, I'm with you on this. I mean, you know, as I look at it, I said, geez, I've still not done justice to it. <laughs> yeah. Because you, so, yes. May with with the highest prayer that all of us reach that first way then level in this very life, you know, highest namaskars to all of you. Huh? Jai Sachitanan. Jai Sachitanan. Highest namaskars. Jai Sachitanan. Yeah, Jai Sachitanan. Kimochi, Jai Sachitanan. Harman, Luz, Elsa. Jai Sachitanan. Carlos, iPhone, iPhone, Guillermo. <laughs> <laughs> And yeah, yeah, huh? Yeah, this, yeah, yeah. Yay, yes. Sachidana. Yay, yeah, Sachidana. Shoot that. Yay, Sachidana. Yeah, yeah. Yay, Sachidana. Yay, Sachidana. Yay, Sachidana. Yeah, right. Okay, everyone. Thank you. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.